Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name's Taylor and today I'm going to be doing a college essentials video. So some of the stuff I'm going to be mentioning, I either brought it or I didn't bring it. I'm going to put in pictures of stuff that I think that you should bring to college and then stuff that I think that you should not bring to college. So I hope you guys enjoy the video. Let's get started. So the first thing that I would bring with me to college that I regret not bringing the first time is a mattress pad. It's basically like a little memory foam pad that you put on top of your mattress and it makes it really nice and comfortable like an actual mattress that you would have at home in your bedroom. Um, at least at my college, the mattresses that they give you are not very comfortable at all. So I would definitely get one of those. They're kind of expensive, but in my opinion, I feel like it's a good splurge because it's going to make you comfortable. If you can't sleep good at night, how are you going to be able to get up in the morning and be productive for school? You're not. So that's one of the things that I would... Next thing that I would bring is a fan. My room, it gets... Especially in the summer. I'm in West Virginia, so in the winter it's not really that big of a deal, but... In the summer, it gets so hot in my room because they like they don't really clean the um, vents, so it all just gets stuck up there and the AC doesn't run through very well. So a fan would definitely be on like the top of my list and that's one thing that I did not bring was a fan and I, I really regret it so much because it gets so hot in here. Um, I would definitely go with an oscillating fan so it goes throughout the whole room, but if you can't, then you can't. A fan is great. I would definitely recommend getting a fan. The next thing that I would recommend bringing is a TV. They do not provide you with a TV. So even like a little tiny TV would be okay just to have. And also along with that, if, cause normally they don't have cable at colleges. So I would get like a little adapter that you can adapt an HDMI cord to and then adapt it and then put it on your computer and you can turn Netflix and whatever else on from your computer and it will go onto the TV. Or if you have like an Xbox or a PlayStation or something like that, then that's easy. You can just um, adapt that to your TV and so on and so forth. So that is another thing that I would get a TV and then an, adapt an adaption cord if you need it. Next thing that I would recommend getting is blackout curtains, but don't get the color black. Get like white, pink, like something along those lines. Cause if you get black, it's just gonna make it even more hot in your room. I have blackout curtains and they are black, but I regret it because now it gets more hot in my room. So I would definitely recommend getting those because all they provide you with is like blinds and sometimes that's not good enough. You want blackout curtains to sleep a little bit better at night. So I would definitely recommend. The next thing I would recommend getting is storage bins for your bathroom. At my college, we get like, they're not huge bathrooms, but they're kind of big and they don't come with a lot of storage. We have like a little tiny cabinet and that's about all the storage you get. So um, bins or like storage bins, organization bins, anything along those lines for your bathroom, I would definitely, definitely get. They're very helpful. They don't have to be expensive or anything. I have like the plastic ones, so I would get those. They're really nice and they help you organize everything. The next thing that I would bring is flip-flops for the shower. We don't have a communal shower in my dorm. We have like where two people share one bathroom and two people share the other, but still, if you wanna wear flip-flops in the bathroom, I would because sometimes it can get pretty disgusting. The next thing that I would get is a little like shower rack that you can put over the shower head or like some shelves that you can put on the shower with um, like with the little wall things that you can take right off the wall because I don't have one of those and it's really helpful because then you don't have to just like place, find places to place all of your shower things, um, in the shower. So that would be very helpful. Next thing that I would recommend getting, it's not a requirement, but, um, it's kind of like very minimal. I would recommend getting a shoe rack because I, well, I personally don't have a lot of shoes, but if you do, it would help a lot to have a shoe rack. Next thing I would recommend bringing is a few blankets, um, like obviously to cover up with, but if you can't see right here in my closet, we don't have doors. So if you wanna cover up your closet cause you have a mess or if you just don't want people looking in your closet, you can put a little blanket over it or a tapestry or something to cover it. And it helps a lot because when people come in, they don't just see your clothes and stuff. So that's very helpful. Next thing I would recommend getting is a nice laptop. 
Um, I do all of my schoolwork on my laptop and it's very hard to do it if you don't have a laptop because most of the time now in 2023, things aren't on pen and paper, they're on like canvas or something like that. So a laptop is a great idea to bring. And the last thing that I would recommend bringing is nice shoes, like tennis shoes, something like that. Obviously, if you have slides or something, I would bring those too just to be comfortable in. But if you're gonna, especially if you're gonna be walking around a lot, I would definitely bring some tennis shoes or something because to support your feet, support your legs, it, you're gonna get uncomfortable if you're walking a lot. And my campus, it's not very big, but it's a decent size. So walking is very uncomfortable. All right, guys, that's all for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe down below, and I will see you guys in my next video.